right, y'all. Welcome back. It's Big Al with Stock Lock Sunday, the world famous Stock Lock Sunday. All right, so what do we have in front of us here? What is this strange looking lock? Well, it's a Moomin. Uh, you might have seen a couple of them on YouTube by now. Uh, I have. Uh, crazy looking little, uh, almost looks like a toy, um, but it's an actual Abloy classic lock, believe it or not. Uh, these are sort of a collector's thing. This is my first. Um, I do plan on getting the other eight. As far as I know, there are nine to collect, uh, each one having a different character on it, as you can see right there through the little peephole. Uh, but yeah, it's an actual Abloy lock. With a, uh, I put down a couple notes over here I'm trying to read for you. Um, it has a uh, uh, die-cast zinc body with plastic around it. Uh, we'll get to that when we open it up. Uh, it is, again, Abloy Classic 318 core in that thing. Crazy, right? Uh, nine different characters, and obviously they come out of Finland, as it says right here. That is the issue uh, with me right now. I'm uh, shipping them here from Finland. Uh, it's, it's, it's pretty costly, the shipping is, but, you know, again, if you want to collect them, you're going to pay a little extra, right? All right, so what is it? It's a it's an Abloy lock. Let's tear it open. Uh, pretty cool. Um, got some of the characters here on the back. Look inside, color your own character, which is inside the package inside there. So really, really neat little neat little object here. Let's see if we can get it open. And bada boom, bada bing. There is the lock. There's your little character on the front of it, and on the back we got the Moomin. Uh, set that down a second, and I'll show you. So in the bottom here, that's where the keys lie, and there they are, the Abloy keys. How cool is that? Really, really, really cool. I'm pretty excited about it. Uh, so, that little coloring character dude, right inside here. Oh, there's actually a couple of them. You got one on this side here. Color it. Color, cut, and play. Uh, so, something for kids, I'm, I imagine. And then there's another one here. So, pretty neat, right? For a collector's item. Like I said, I, I plan on getting the other eight. <laughs> they, they got me. So here it is. There is the Abloy lock. Here is the Abloy keys. How does it work? Well, you put the key in the keyhole. Key in the keyhole. Like so. You rotate it and bada boom, bada bang. So, uh, you know, not, not no high security lock, but I've got to tell you, that's a high security core. I consider Abloy locks high security. Um, you know, they take, they require special tools and special skills to pick them. So, but you know, not the strongest of locks, as you can tell by looking at it, um, how it locks, it just rotates. You can see the little locking deal. Hopefully it's focusing for me inside the hole there. See it rotate and it just kind of grabs a hold of this cut out on the shackle here, locking it, but just really, really cool. So why did I get it? Well, I'm getting into Abloy locks. Uh, you've seen, um, if you've been watching my channel for a little bit, you know I've gotten pretty decent with this detainer lock, so I decided to step up my game a little bit. So, you know I got the silver bullet. Well, there's a silver bullet. So I contacted Matt, the guy that designed the original silver bullet, uh, Matt Smith, and he made me some custom tips for Abloy. And here they are. So I had to do nothing to my silver bullet. Nothing at all. He made the tips so they, they just, they're, you know, the silver bullet's modular. You just change the tips out like you would the other tips. And now it's an Abloy picking tool. Just phenomenal. <laughs> really phenomenal. He did a great, great job. Uh, I have no experience beforehand with um, Abloy locks and, uh, I, you know, getting these tips, I was able to step right into it. So let's do this. Let me uh, put this thing in the vise here. Um, one thing I did notice um, on picking this one, at least, um, on disc detainer locks, I always rotate the disc fully clockwise and then start picking. Not the case on this. So I don't know if that's with all Abloy locks because uh, I picked another Abloy Classic, the cam lock, and uh, I did it by rotating all the disc clockwise first. So I guess it's it depends on the lock. So we're going to put it in the vise here. I'm going to bring the camera around for a good view. Rotato, put it over here, uh, bring it down some. Uh, let me see, we could probably get a better shot than that. How about right there? Let's see if I can get it straight. That might work right there. Let's see. All right, so again, I don't rotate the disc, so I'm going to show you. Put the key back in the lock if I can find the. Now I can't see where I'm at. 
Okay, where's the hole? There it is. All right, so that's open. That's locked. All right, so we're not going to rotate the disc. I'm going to put my abloy tool into the lock. Boy, I'm picking blind down here. All right, so all the way in. Bada boom, bada bang. I'm going to get that next disc with the pick tip right there. Now I'm going to put tension on that rear one and get to picking. These are not easy for me, by the way, so uh, bear with me. I have very little experience thus far. That feels good. Come out and get the next disc. Right here. It's tight. There we go. Next disc. If I can find it. Here it is. Tight. I think that's it there. I'm going to roll with that. We might have to come back to it. Next disc. Tight. That feels good. Next disc. I'm not sure if that's... I may, I may come back to that one. That feels good right there. I may leave it. Next one. Tight. There we go, that felt good. Right there. Next. Tight. That feels good. Next disc. Right here. Tight. Tight. There it is. Locks open. Just like that. Bada boom, bada bang. Let me get this out of here somehow. There it is. So that's how you do it. Pretty flipping exciting, right? Let me get this tool out of there. I don't think you have to lock it back up for this one. Oh, maybe so. I'll lock it back up. There it is. There's my uh, first Abloy lock picked on camera. The uh, Abloy 318 and the uh, Moomin Collector's lock. So, pretty excited. Uh, I want to give a big shout out to uh, Matt Smith for designing this uh, abloy tip for me for the Silver Bullet. Just an outstanding job. Phenomenal. Thanks, Matt. I really appreciate you. All right, that's it. Thank you all so much for watching. Uh, if you're not subscribed yet, please do so. If you want to see more cool stuff like this, uh, subscribe. Hit the like button and uh, let me know in the comments what you think. All right, thank you.